Hello everyone, we are working out this coordinate geometry question. We are given a graph and we are asked to determine the gradient of the red line on the graph. So what we need is two points. And the first point is 0 and 4. And the second point P has coordinates 5, 0. So we can say y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So y2 would be 4 and y1 would be 0. x2 could be 0 and x1 would be 5. So we have 4 over negative 5, the answer is negative 4 fifths. Negative 4 over 5. Let's find the equation of the line. Y is equal to mx plus c because it's a straight line. This is the general form of the equation. So c is the y-intercept which is equal to 4. And m is the gradient of the line, which is equal to negative 4 over 5, as we worked out before. So we just need to substitute these values into the equation, and we have y is equal to negative 4 over 5 x plus 4. Because c is equal to 4 and m is equal to negative 4 over 5, so we just replace m and c by the values that we worked out. Part 3 the equation of the perpendicular line that passes through p. So the gradient of the perpendicular line of the perpendicular line would be equal to negative 1 over the gradient of the line. So negative 1 over negative 4 over 5, which is equal to 5 over 4. Remember, a negative number divided by a negative number gives a positive number. And we have one point on the line. So Let's find the y-intercept of the perpendicular line. So we have y is equal to mx plus c. We in the equation of the perpendicular line. And we have the point 5, 0. So p has coordinates 5 and 0. Okay, so let's work out, let's substitute the values for x and y, so x will be equal to 5 and y will be equal to 0, so we have m times 5 plus c, m is equal to 5 over 4, so 0 is equal to 5 over 4 times 5. Plus C. So here is equal to 5 times 5 is 25 or 4 plus C. So, so C would therefore be equal to negative 25 over 4. So C is the y intercept of the perpendicular line. And now we have the value of c and we have the value of m and we can now write our equation of the perpendicular line so we're using y equal to mx plus c and we are substituting m is equal to 5 over 4 and we are substituting c is equal to negative 25 over 4 
So we have y equals 5 over 4x subtract 25 over 4. This is our answer. Thanks for watching. I do have a productive day.